Ridgefield High School is a public high school in Ridgefield, Connecticut, United States. It is part of the Ridgefield School District. It was ranked 119th in Newsweek's 2015 list of the top 1,600 high schools in America and 226th in U.S. News and World Report's 2012 list of the top 4,813 high schools. The school's dropout rate has remained consistent over the years at 1%. Daily attendance has been similarly steady at 95%. 341 students took 754 advanced placement exams in May 2006, with 92. 2% of exams with scores of 3 or higher. In the 8 years up through the 2005-2006 to 2006 school year, the number of students taking AP exams has tripled. Ridgefield High School offers 20 AP classes, as well as multiple UConn Early College Experience classes in multivariable calculus. In 2012, a number of computer-related subjects were added to the curriculum, including computer art, computer music, engineering, digital design studio, and advanced placement computer science. However, the latter is only available in alternating years. For the purpose of comparison with the achievement levels of similar schools, the State Department of Education classifies schools and communities in district reference groups, defined as districts whose students' families are similar in education, income, occupation and need, and that have roughly similar enrollment. Ridgefield is one of eight school districts in District Reference Group A. Students and alumni of Ridgefield High School have won many prestigious academic honors. RHS regularly produces 8-12 to 12 National Merit Scholarship finalists annually, though the class of 2019 was a notable exception to this trend. Graduates of Ridgefield High School have won full rides to colleges such as Duke University, the University of Virginia, and the University of Michigan. RHS students have also been named Presidential Scholars, a Coca-Cola Scholar, a Lieberman Scholar, a Jefferson Scholar, Stamp Scholars, Mork's Family Scholars, A, B Scholars, and more. The school has also produced multiple student representatives to the Connecticut State Board of Education. About 65% of the student body participates in at least one interscholastic athletic activity. It is a member of the Fairfield County Interscholastic Athletic Conference and is in Class LL for states. Each year RHS sends many students to play a variety of sports at the collegiate level. In 2019, Ridgefield High School added fencing to its list of sports, on the club level. The school's facilities include a two-story high, glass-enclosed student center and all-marble student life office. The school has a football stadium with turf field and a turf practice field adjacent to that. Over the years, but especially so in the past few, Ridgefield High School has attracted its fair share of controversy. In October 2017, a video of a Ridgefield High School student along with a then-recent alum painted in blackface with the headline nigger went viral on social media. The post was shared hundreds of times, and deeply upset some students of color who pointed out that Ridgefield as a town is 96% white. There was also additional controversy regarding the administration's decision to discipline student reporters who shared the information prior to extensive fact-checking leading to the spread of some misinformation regarding the administration's training of faculty members. A wet baseball field was doused with 24 gallons of gasoline and set on fire in a failed attempt to dry the field for a Ridgefield High School varsity baseball game in April 2019. Three RHS varsity baseball coaches were placed on administrative leave pending the outcome of a police investigation. The cost to restore the field to pre-fire condition was estimated to be in excess of $50,000. In 2014, a series of hazing events left many underclassmen students intoxicated as they attended class. The breadth of students that were affected by this event garnered much media coverage, with the bulk of the students being involved with athletic teams at the school. The hazing occurred as part of the school's homecoming spirit week. In 2019, the school took steps to prevent hazing among its athletic teams. During the 2017-2018 academic year, there were no fewer than five instances of swastikas drawn on or around school grounds. On September 8, 2017, an anti-Semitic symbol was found etched into a table at Ridgefield High School. A little more than two months later, on Tuesday, November 21, a swastika was found drawn on the inside of a classroom door at Ridgefield High School. Additional anti-Semitic symbols were found in January, June, and August. All these events led to the creation of a program for town officials to do more than condemn the events. In the 2018-2019 academic year, Ridgefield High School saw a surge in threats of violence against staff and students. In late May 2019, a student was arrested for threatening to initiate a school shooting. The student, 
whose name was not released because he or she is a minor, was charged with threatening in the first degree and breach of peace in the second degree. Earlier that year, there were instances of bomb threats in December and January. There was also an undisclosed threat made on social media in March of the same academic year. Previous bomb threats had been made at RHS in 2007, 2008, and 2012. Thanks for watching.